frontiers of Flight Museum, there's an exact replica of the Spaceship One. This was a private project in 2004 to create a reusable space vehicle. Spaceship One was designed to fly 62.5 miles above the Earth's surface. That's about the same distance as two and a half full-length marathons put end to end. A normal commercial airplane flies between 5.9 and 7.2 miles high. This model of aircraft has several design features that allow it to accomplish these goals. One unique design feature is the feathered wing joint. Spaceship One's wings can fold upwards 70 degrees mid-flight. We wonder, why would they design the wings to fold? What advantages could this create? The answer lies in surface area. Surface area is the area of an outer part or uppermost layer. When the wings fold up to the feathered position, there's more surface area for air resistance. Air resistance is a force that acts against the movement of an object, slowing it down. The pilot of Spaceship One will use this feathered position for a slow, steady re-entry into the Earth's atmosphere. You can do an experiment at home to see how the feathered wing helps Spaceship One slow down. All you need are two shuttlecocks, a pair of scissors, a timer, and a tall height, like a stairwell or balcony. Get some help to cut off the feathering of one of the shuttlecocks. Now, drop each shuttlecock from a tall height and time how long each one takes to hit the ground. We see that the shuttlecock with feathering takes longer to hit the ground because the feathering increases the surface area for air resistance to slow down the object. What other examples of air resistance can you find around you?